Hi friends, my name is Akil Ahmed and in this particular video tutorial, we will look at sorting data in SQL Server. So the agenda of today's video tutorial is how to sort data in SQL tables. So let's jump to the demo. So I got an employee table here and let me try to select the data from the employee table. Select a star from employee and if I execute the query, so it will retrieve the data from the table like how the data is stored on the disk. So when you create a table and if you create a cluster index on the table, then the table is called as a cluster table. And if you don't have a cluster index on a table, then the table is called as a heap. So when you create a cluster index on a table, then it physically sort the data on the columns on which you have created the cluster index. So for example, if you have created the cluster index on the ID column, then it will actually physically sort the data on the disk on the ID column. So when you will retrieve the data from the table so it will automatically sort the data based on the id column so you don't need to put in any sorting condition here but in case if you want to sort the data based on a particular specific column then you can use the order by clause in the sql server to sort the data so right now uh, we have multiple columns here and suppose if you want to sort the data based on the age then you can write an order by condition here order by and the column name so i want to sort the data based on the age so i can just provide the column name here now there are two options here either you can sort the data in the ascending order or you can sort the data in the descending order as well so suppose if you want to sort the data in the ascending order then you can write asc however asc is optional so if you want to write anything then the data will be sorted in the ascending order and if you want to sort the data in the descending order, then you need to write DESC. So first let's try to sort the data in the ascending order of the age. So if I execute this query, then it will sort the data based on the ascending order of the age. And if we need to sort the data based on the descending order, then instead of the ASC, I can write DESC. So if I execute the query now, then the data got sorted in the descending order. Okay. And you can also sort the data based on multiple columns as well. For example, if you want to sort the data based on the descending order of the age and based on the ascending order of the date of joining, then you can write the another condition separated by a comma. So I can write comma DOJ. And if you want to sort it based on the ascending order, then the ASC is the optional. So you don't need to write anything here. And if you execute this query, then it will sort the data based on the descending order of the age and based on the ascending order of the DOJ. So the data got sorted here. So this is how you can just sort the data using the order by clause in the SQL server and the order by clause should needs to be put in the end. So suppose if you have some where condition, then the where condition should needs to be put between the table name and the order by clause and the order by will come in the end. So suppose if I need to filter the data where age is 40, then I can write a condition where age equal to 40 and then the order by age. So the order by clause will come in the end and the rest of the query will come in the beginning. So this is how you can sort the data using the order by clause. So I will share the create table statement and the insert query for the employee table so that you can create it on your database as well. Yeah, so I think that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching the video and if you like the video then please click the like button. Do subscribe to our channel press the bell icon and click on all so that you will be notified every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much.